Hello friend, welcome to Algo Trading Tutorial. Uh, in our previous video, we already discussed about how to place buy order and sell order. In this video, we are going to discuss about the quote method. So, to understand the quote method, uh, we click here in the browser, open a tab, uh, right here google.com to for search, uh, type here in the search window kite connect module okay so click on the kite connect api documentation okay so this is the kite connect documentation kite connect module here the kite connect classes and uh, inside this kite connect classes this is the, these are the methods which uh, are used for algo trading so in these all these methods today we are discuss about the quote method this is the quote and click on this quote method and definition quote self instrument quote method is used to get the current market details of a stock or any instrument like future options anything suppose when we need the current market price of infosys stock then we use this quote method to get uh, the infosys details in real time so that we uh, we can use it in our logic uh, that is compare or some price or anything then uh, we use this quote method so now we are going to our uh, programming window where we can learn to how to use uh, quote method okay so go to the spider open spider window i already open uh, here so this is our uh, this is all that things we already discussed in our previous videos no modification is there all file is same as our previous video so now we uh, create another file here to understand the quote method okay first uh, click on this uh, create a file uh, untitled and uh, save it save uh, save as this is the module one inside click on inside place order and this is the quote method quote uh, method dot pi okay save it here this is the quote method and delete this uh, oh, line okay and save it so this is our place order already we have discussed in our previous video so now this is the code method so from here uh, some thing is that uh, click on this uh, place order so we all uh, we need these uh, three lines for this coding okay copy these three line from here to get method okay and uh, this is the definition order place and uh, of course uh, we use here we use here definition code so now open again the kite module documentation page okay this is browser and kite api documentation page here look at here definition code uh, is here and in this definition code we have to pass the symbol of the desired stock or option any option future etc anything so the format will be the exchange colon trading symbol uh, for example is here nsc colon infosys infi so okay open spider window this uh, in here we first put def def definition quote we first create a function to run this quote method okay so pass uh, this this is symbol okay and uh, open place order again from here we copy first uh, we copy uh, in and definition order place copy these two line from here to 
our code method code here a uh, lot of copy paste required to <laughs> coding so next uh, you have to run the code method so copy uh, kite and uh, is this is actually we instantiate kite object here and kite and fetch our api key and access token to the kite object and then we code run our code method so open again the documentation page and this is the method okay code okay copy this code from kite.code and of course the this is symbol s y m b o l and get this uh, written uh, code symbol get uh, the details of this code method run to a variable so the code details q u o t code underscore d e t a i l s equal to okay so now and return it return the code details r e t u r and return code details okay they see so this is the code uh, code method okay code method uh, def change uh, this uh, definition to code method m a t h o t code method okay this code or this code same so you don't confused so now run this and here this is a logging import uh, imported but not yours we need not this logging module so comment it off okay so run this code method so code testing t s t i n this testing comment up and run this code method from here and a symbol here and do we put here the infosys uh, infosys and infosys is my favorite stuff so <laughs> every time i put it infosys by default nsc mf so the this is the cash market and uh, the exchange is nsc so this is in fee nsc in fee if the exchange is bsc then you put it here bsc okay and uh, this symbol is passed in quote method and, and some details equals to and print these details here p r i n t details d t a i l s details so after that so now we are going to run this program so before running this program you should not forget to generate access token uh, so how to generate access token we already discussed in our previous video so go to the previous video and uh, learn how to generate access token from api key or api secret so after getting the access token uh, uh, for this example i already discussed uh, in our previous video to run our buy order and sell order kite get access token run this and then uh, put the request token to uh, in this file and then we will get the request token okay so in this uh, uh, now we are going to run quote method so okay just uh, place run button again and so the code method is run successfully and this is uh, this is the return uh, download and uh, this is the details for the nsc code from uh, current market and this uh, for this uh, print details so here uh, print these details so this is first look at here nsc colon infi 
this is the symbol and the all the details from the NSC uh, in fee stocks uh, so first instrument token timestamp last trade time details last price buy quantity sell quantity and all that things uh, you will get through quote method so quote method is very necessary uh, for your algo trading so that you can get the current market price, large trade value, quantity, open interest, buy quantity, sell quantity, uh, volume, everything from this quote method. So quote method is very important. So now we are uh, download or get your option data from uh, this quote method. So to get the option data, we first uh, need the option symbol. So go to browser again and uh, I enter in my trading account. Mm. And here. one option uh, down uh, from nifty one five seven hundred okay this is the nifty fifth july 15th july 15 700 from here uh, from technicals click on technicals so this is the symbol of Nifty 15,700 uh, call option for month of 15th July. Copy this symbol from here towards here. The symbol copy here. Uh, replace this in fit to this option symbol and change this NSC exchange to NFO because this is future option and future mm. FNO change uh, this symbol is belongs to option and future market FNO NFO 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 sorry NFO okay now run this method again save it and run again okay so run successfully and we will get the details of nifty 15th and july option so nfo nifty this is option symbol and the details belongs to this option symbol so from uh, this code we get the current option details it is uh, required for uh, our algo trading so okay so in this way we get the future uh, and uh, one example is uh, for future okay just go to browser again and close that nifty future n-i-f-t-y f-u-t foot uh, nifty july future okay and uh, get the symbol from here uh, technical and this is the symbol and here is also is nfo on bracketed so nfo is here uh, here nfo and copy it here and run this code so this is the future nifty future july future details is here and from these details we get uh, the value which we required so in our next video i will uh, tell you how to access this data actually this data is in a dictionary format of uh, python so how to access this uh, dictionary data format uh, so i will make a video on this in our uh, most probably in our next video i will discuss 
uh, to get access this data and how to use this data in our program so okay thank you for watching this video